right what is good youtube uh today's video yo adrian build my personal favorite creative player aka ball player whatever you want to call it build uh for diamond dynasty how to get it what my perks are what my equipment is how to farm this archetype really fast and where i think you should play this position or, or this yo adrian archetype in your diamond dynasty lineup where you should put him it's not in his primary um and why i think that's the best strategy to to take in dd in this current meta as of june 6 2021 so first and foremost what is the o adrian build clearly you see right here up oh, let me you don't see it let me just change to the camera so you do see it um the yo adrian it is the archetype it is a primary third baseman let's go to all stats you farm you see all the boosts you get from the yo adrian it's a primary third base go to the view the program blah 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 now all right let me start fresh here how do you get the yo adrian build first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go down here you're gonna pick slugger as the archetype you start to work with right now what you're gonna do after this is you're gonna farm your archetype quickly how do you do that short form version is you do the road to the show sim uh exploit whatever it is to farm the archetype as fast as you can i'm not going to go over all of that again because i already made a video on it but it will be in the description how to farm archetypes quickly but for the sake of this video and just the, the specificity of the yo adrian i'm going to just not cover that right now and just tell you that you start with a slugger and then you pick the uh sparking slugger that is i believe the path you take for the i'm just gonna double check here to make sure uh i'm almost 100 percent positive it is but you know you doubt yourself when you talk about stuff so uh cap hat i have it written down here let's open this up and to see the yo adrian just to, just to make sure because i don't want to lead you guys astray and give you the wrong answers oh i apologize it's not sparking you go from slugger to slick slugger right down here you go first archetype you pick a slugger you grind it and then when you get the silver archetype choice pack from grinding it you have to go to diamond dynasty into your inventory and open it there then you pick slick slugger and activate that one um grind it up again and then the next one up it's easy at this point because it's literally called the yo adrian it's just a gold version of it then you do yo adrian you grind that one up you do the program for that inroad to the show and then you unlock the diamond yo adrian that is the simple way of saying it. I know there's more details. If you want to know how to do the methods of sim this fast and get it done ASAP, the link will be in the description for the how to grind your archetype in two hours from bronze to diamond video. Check it out. It's one of our more popular videos because of how um, crazy the method is, to be honest. So now, what are the perks I put on? Speed 7. This I, I credit to Satch for this one, I believe it was. Uh, he he uh, he's a Twitch viewer of mine, and he said that if you a if you drop one of your contact perks and add speed seven, you get you only lose, uh, you only are you're only gonna lose two of your power points while gaining a lot of speed. So it's plus fourteen to your speed, plus sevens to your contact, and minus fives to your power. Now, when I reworked everything around, I only ended up losing two of my power points. And to give you a perspective of what my numbers are attribute-wise, uh, to save you the math, I uh, with equipment and all my boosts, I'm 125 contacts, 113 powers, I have a 95 speed, I have a 94 fielding. I would have 99, but I'm in my secondary. 94 in my secondary fielding, 99 arm strength with a 95 speed. And where do I play this guy? Behind the dish. He is a catcher with 94 fielding, 99 arm, 95 speed, and 125 contacts, 113 powers. That is unbelievable, guys. That is the highest value position you can get right now in Diamond Dynasty. In my opinion, you will not get a catcher anywhere close to that value. So now back to the perks. Speed seven. Those are what, this is the perks I got for that. Speed seven is the first one. Next one is power six, plus seven powers, minus four clutch, minus three fielding, minus five reaction. Obviously, when you see those minuses, you have to work around with your equipment and what you do otherwise so you can negate those subtractions. Contact six plus nine contacts plus five vision minus six accuracy and reaction time. All good. Contact two plus tens for the contact plus 10 clutch minus four powers. Those are the builds, the perks, I should say, I have on this build for the Yo Adrian to get to where I am right now. Um, and equipment. I have the Radar EV pitch I wear on. I have the Vapor Slider Sleeve 2 Compression Sleeve. I have the Legendary Call Ritual Item. Wrist Guard Performance Wrist Guard. I have Pro Knit V2 Batting Gloves. 
back grip dsp back grip jackie robinson guys do the jackie robinson conquest it is so high value most of my good equipment all the best equipment i have is from that conquest it's super quick super easy and it really helps out your ball player bat jackie robinson collector's edition that is from i guess the pre-order i got jackie robinson day diamond pro otc socks the cleats i have the jackie robinson griffey one medals shin guard i have bpg 42.0s leg guards you guys can't see right now but cs7 axis leg guards field glove i have flawless see it right here flawless field glove i'll just show y'all elbow guard it's just elbow guard from marucci i guess this one had a generic name so i'll show you guys too this wrist guard was performance wrist guards actually the 44 pro gold so in case you wanted to see that uh elbow guard it's the marucci elbow guard like i said chest protector jordan chest protector plus four blocking catch your mask i got the plus eight block now when new equipment comes out um that allows me to get a better blocking for my catcher like a chest protector and all that other stuff i will get it i'm sure if i'm missing something probably with equipment but right now my guy is insane so that is the basic build for my yo adrian now how do i get this dirty little boy behind the dish i did a video on it but i'll show you again really quick because it's pretty simple i have a catcher build you see this slick fielding primary uh that's not the right button go to catcher we'll, we'll enable him right now we'll activate him what is his primary perk we'll see he's a catcher preferred as a slick fielding you activate a catcher all you need to do is have the bronze archetype slick fielding equipped on this random build it doesn't matter because all your obviously all your ball players base stats carry over no matter what the build is so catcher slick fielding blah 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 activate it now boom back out we're in dd see now it doesn't say secondary my catcher is right here it's his primary position whatever that's what you want how do you get your yo adrian to play behind the dish though and not drop balls because it's in the secondary position which is what would happen if you did that the main screen you go to rank seasons this is only good for rank seasons by the way guys you can't you can't use the yo adrian behind the dish in offline modes at least i'm not at least i'm as far as i'm aware it says your catcher it says active loadout is your that's uh incorrect it's actually the catcher because uh, as you guys see sometimes this is just glitchy when you go to queue up right now your catcher your slick fielding is behind the dish it's primary it's in his it's in his position he's fine he's not in the secondary when you're selecting a lot you pick the adrian and then you queue up that's simple as that it's easy it works trust me guys i've been doing it for weeks now it's it works totally fine it is the way to go so that is how you get the most value out of your cap behind the dish um and look he's still in his primary so guys that's how you do that um make sure big thing to do I, I think i covered it already but I'll go over it again i told you what archetype to pick guys i told you where when you when you grind your archetype up from bronze to silver silver to gold whatever gold to diamond you have to the pack is going to appear in your dd packs inventory you have to open it there it's very important uh, i showed you the perks i use guys the perks are earned from the archetype program and if they're not earned there if you have you still if you need some of the perks and you can't get them um, because you don't know where to find them. Here you go, guys. You go to the marketplace. Equipment and perks. Go to perks. You can buy the perks on the marketplace. You'll get them. Trust me, it's where I bought some of mine. So definitely pick the perks up there. Um, you know, that's basically it, guys. Uh, right now, and just to go over the last thing to round it up on this video, why I use the Catcher Cap Yo Adrian build is because in terms of value right now, um, you're never going to find a catcher who's a switch hitting God tier catcher with great defense and really fast at shortstop. You'll find guys like Trevor story who can give you fantastic value, even switch hitters like Ronnie Mauricio, um, who's got, who's got decent speed, but great fielding and good hitting. Um, you just get better value at all these positions right now. I used to have my guy play shortstop and then for a little bit, he played left, but right now with all the updates from TA two, from the new headliners, all the new flawless rewards, whatever it may be. Um, I just find to me that the catcher is the most value. So uh anyways guys if you enjoyed this video uh where we broke down the yo adrian why i like it the most please 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 feel free to like the video comment down below tell me what you guys want to see i love making these videos and sub to the channel don't forget to put that bell on we post gameplay every day at noon eastern time but these kind of videos like this are sprinkled in at night um the tips videos and all this you know kind of sort of video so anyways guys i hope you enjoyed it enjoy the rest of your day i'm out bye